Hi guys, this is Hidden Street Magic. I'm back again and um, you might have been wondering for the past few weeks, some of the videos have been taking really long to upload, alright? Some lasting about like maybe two weeks there before the next video comes out. Now the reason why is because we've been spending a lot of time trying to vet through the competition results, okay? Uh, if you haven't noticed or if you haven't known, we had a competition around like end of July and we have, we have been vetting through the results, we've been vetting through the videos to, to pull out the best results. Like I said, there's $250 worth of magic items for giveaways and we have finally came to a conclusion on the top 3 videos as well as the top 10 winners of the competition. So let's have a look at the videos. Okay, I want to, I want to actually imagine this. You take out a deck of cards. Boy, show empty. Boy, it's not needed anymore. A spectator actually choose a card anywhere they like. Stop. Let's say this card. You scrap the cards and we show them their card. And you don't see them. And you don't see it. After that, you place a deck back. You place a card back. You just wave. You know their card is actually the eight of clubs. Let's let's do it one more time. The cards get selected. This is this card. Without even a spectator looking at it, you know their card is actually the five of hearts. There you go. Let's bring one more step further. You give the card to the spectator and ask them to cut it. Let's say they cut it. And then if you they if they don't reverse shuffle, let them do it. If not, you do it. So you first shuffle. They cut it one more time. You shuffle it one more time. And now you want you ask them. Between the number one to fifty two. Fifty two. Because of they have two cards. Or you think of a number. One to fifty two. Any number you would like. Let's say say ten. Okay, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This is the ten cards. I need to look look at the card and tell me what is the digit. I'm sorry about that. What is the pit? Okay, just tell me the pit. Let's say it's a heart. Immediately, you know it's the four of hearts. But let's bring it one more step further. Any number you would like to add on, for example, so you just say 10. Of course, choose a number, but not too much, otherwise, it will be too easy for me. And just add any number of cards you would like again. Let's say they say 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and these are 8 cards. I want to look at a card and tell me what's the pip again. So what's the space or the hearts or the clubs or diamond. They say it's a clubs. Okay, so it's a clubs, okay? And I have no idea what it is. What it is. You take the card and I've never looked at it anymore. Immediately, the snap, I actually know your card is the Queen of Clubs. And there you go. This is the any card at any number routine. <laughs> show you this trick this is called the color change so I need to have one card you, you just let me stop anyway as I put my thumb down okay you, you can speak it's okay don't need to use hand stop here yeah you want to change no try right here okay I look at this card this is the what card is this I'm not sure this is two of space <laughs> okay. okay I see you don't play cards Color change is like this. Nothing here. Watch. I just take the card, give it a shake, and it changes color. Yeah, that's the trick. Wait, I think no. Uh, this is just a joke. So, actually, I try with the whole deck. Because like that, one card is not very impressive. Watch. I blow. Zoom in. Look here. Can you see the deck? The, all the cards. Watch. Look at the cards. 
all chains to red. Okay, maybe you're thinking all the cards are actually red in the first place. How much? I change it back, just snap. So now there's red and there's black. And the deck is ordinary. Hi guys, for this video, I'm going to perform an amazing trick first and then I'm going to do a detailed tutorial on how to do it. So first, you have a cut, any cut, it can be any cut, and the, and the spectator is going to sign on it. So let's say just stand at this, and then you will have any cut box or whatever box. And this box is as absolutely empty as you can see. It's empty. Okay. And this can and this cut box is not gimmicked, so it can be examined by spectators. No, before and after the trick. Now, I'm going to explain what I am going to do later. I'm going to let this card penetrate the card box, and so don't blank because you're going to miss a trick if you blank. So now watch this. There's nothing in my hands, absolutely empty. If you just give the card box a flick, the card the card actually disappeared and appeared right inside the card box. The cards can be examined by the spectators, both the card box and the card. As well, normal, you can give them as a souvenir to the to the audience. All right, so that's the top three winners for the competition, and I hope you really enjoyed them. Some of the ideas are pretty creative and new, or rather, an integration of the older techniques to create something new. Anyway, I would like to really thank you all for submitting all the videos. We've got 380 over videos, and that's a lot. It was overwhelming. I didn't expect that many videos, but I want to thank you for that. You know, it's amazing how I, I just don't get it because if I if you look at my video views, it is less than 300 over. Yeah. Yet I get 300 over submissions. So and and what I really mean is distinct submissions. That means individual people. So I have no idea how people know about my video sometimes. But thank you very much for viewing, and uh, I really hope that you guys can continue pursuing into magic, get better at it, and I'll be contacting some of you for uh, an integration or collaboration with Hidden Strip Magic and we'll see how we can work on from there. For those of you who have actually won gifts, I'll be contacting you soon and I'll be sending the gifts right to your doorstep at zero cost to you, alright? So thank you very much, stay tuned, like, subscribe and have fun.